What's up ladies and gentlemen, it's The Real Philly Feel here, and today we are shooting a new series that I like to call, Is It Worth It? Where I review some of the stuff that I have in my everyday life that you may want to pick up as a consumer, and we take a look at it and see if it's really worth it. So today, to surprise, it's a new year and I decided to get a little more serious with YouTube, so I decided to get myself a tripod, which this lovely phone is being held on. And it looks like it's a very good tripod because honestly it's holding my smartphone with the cord that dangles from it. It's the cord that basically hooks the microphone into the phone and a charging cable because my phone's a little low on battery. But either way, it's called the Photo Pro Series 50 inch tripod. The question is, is it worth it? Well, we're going to base our reviews on three components. One design, two functionality, and three the price. So let's get into it. Number one, design. Well, I think it's about time we insert a picture of it right here. Honestly, this looks like any other tripod that I would see on the market. I mean, it's made of aluminum. It's pretty sturdy. It's three-legged. That's why it's called a tripod. A tri means three, so that's why it's called a tripod. It's very useful, plus it comes with a carrying case. So you can basically take it on your next family trip and snap a shot with a phone or a camcorder or a DSLR. It's really useful. So that's why I really like it on the design aspect. Now we go to number two, functionality. Now, one of the main things I love about all tripods is that there is actually a bubble level on the side of the spot where the device will be held. So you can tell when a shot is level or not. Basically, if you never used a bubble level before, basically what you wanna do is get that little tiny bubble between the two little lines. That means you're leveled. It's really cool. Plus, it stretches out to 50 inches, which is really good for a person that's very tall, like myself, because I am six foot two when I'm standing up. I know I look pretty short, because the Teen Titans picture is all the way at the top of the footage. But to be honest, when I stand up, I'm very tall. So from a distance, you can really shoot a lot of great things with this device. And now finally, we go to number three, the price. Now, technically, I bought this one off of Amazon. Now, just to give you a reference, I'm going to be using Amazon as the main component shopping site for all my videos. By the way, if you really want to get some really nice stuff, for a decent price, go to Amazon. They actually have a lot of great things. So let me open up the Amazon shop app on my tablet. Just let you know, this is the first time I'm ever using this. Let me search, uh, just general search, try pod. There we go, it's going up. And we've got a few here. Honestly, if you're a very sophisticated photographer or videographer, as I like to call it, you're probably going to be going with these ones that are higher end. This one from the newer company is called the newer carbon fiber 67 inch 170 centimeter tripod. Goes for $169 and doubles as a selfie stick. That's pretty cool. But we're not talking about that one. We are talking about the one that I have right here that I am filming on. Let's get into it. So honestly, I bought this sucker for eight bucks. I was like, I'm probably gonna get ripped off. But to be honest, it's a tripod. You're not really gonna get ripped off. There's also another one here. It is a 50 inch aluminum camera tripod for Canon, Nikon, Sony, Samsung, Olympus, Panasonic, and Pentex cameras. It's basically the same as this one that I have right here. And the cost for a 50 inch one is $9.95. So basically, if you wanna get a starter out one, which is 50 inches like the one I have here, you're gonna spend around 10 bucks. But if you wanna go for more length, it's gonna cost you. It says for the same one, but except it goes up to 72 inches, you're gonna spend around $24, $23.99 if you wanna be technical. And if you wanna spend the extra money for a 75 inch, you're probably gonna be spending close to $30. So that's actually not too bad. Honestly, the price is really great. So now I must answer the question, is it worth it? Hell yeah, it's worth it. Most recently, if you watched the 2017 vlog or the New Year's vlog, it's gonna be linked down below. Uh, you may have noticed I kept the mic way too far from my mouth and the audio was so, <laughs> I know I cussed, sorry. The audio was so I was like, yeah, that's not gonna be good. So I decided to move the mic closer to my mouth. But either way, ladies and gentlemen, that wraps it up for this video. It's worth it. Go get yourself one if you're gonna be a YouTuber like me or if you're gonna shoot professional videos or professional photography, go get yourself one of these. It's really nice, less than 10 bucks and you get one of these suckers. It's pretty damn cool. So leave a like if you enjoy, subscribe if you're different, and as always people, keep it real. Peace. <sighs> new day, new dawn, a new life, and I'm feeling good. <sighs> it's a new year, 2017 has begun. I'm getting dehydrated over here. 
All right, time to break out the old uh, pink water bottle. Oh, yeah, that's better. God bless all the people that suffer with breast cancer. Honestly, the reason I use a pink water bottle is because of you. Plus, these are the only ones that they had at Walmart that were under a dollar. Hi. Well, I guess I'll do this in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> 